Start your engine. Listen, I got a million things I gotta do. Could, couldn't you do this by yourself? 
come on. Where's your spirit? Granddaddy married a Worthington sick man. I know it. Treasure, I don't believe you. Oh, don't be such a skeptic. several during the conflict. Well, don't ask me. Uh, she's the expert. I think it's like that one there. Uh, now that's the Cadillac. Most of the guns were made in France or England and brought in by gun runners. But this one's got the authentic CSA stamp on it. What's that? CSA, Miss Expert. CSA, Confederate States of America. Right. Um... Well, this must be the one. How much is it? It depends on whether you're buying or selling. Actually, we're looking for them. Oh, well, you see, my great-granddaddy buried them, and he gave me the map, and we're going off to find them. That's right. Uh, we're going off to find them, all right. Well, this one's in perfect condition, and I'm asking $2,000 for it. $2,000? Two thousand dollars? Two hundred thousand. Two thousand. Four hundred thousand dollars. Will you be quiet? Uh, excuse me, sir. If uh, what if they weren't in you know what you call mint condition? I'll give you a thousand dollars a piece for them, as long as they have the CSA stamp on. We. I told you. We well, haven't got them yet. I mean, that's just a catalog price. I saw those dollar signs in your eyes. Yeah, that was your reflection. Thanks. Wait. Where'd y'all say you were going to find them? I did. Hey, Bill. You're going to get tired. Just whistle. It'll help keep you awake. <laughs> Will you get your feet off of me, Freak? Jamie. James. Billy. Did uh, your uncle... Uh... My granddaddy? Yeah, well, whatever. Did uh, he ever tell you why they call it Whiskey Mountain? Well, as legend has it, besides the $200,000 worth of whiskey, the regiment also had 25 barrels of whiskey. They said for medical purposes. Four in! This vacation's getting better every minute. When the laughing green of summer waves goodbye and turns her face into the wind And the chill of late September says yesterday won't ever come again Your career. 
Yeah, just let her sleep. I bet these people will know where it is. Maybe. Anyway, I'll do the talking. Hey, old Jim, let them dogs chew on him a bit before they pull him off. And him and Wayne, they hogtied him. They jerked him up so hard, flipped him over the limb. <laughs> Came down on him and knocked them all out. <laughs> Vacation, remember? Yeah, vacation, remember. Hey, Luke. This one of them new under-the-arm uh, vacuum cleaners? Get that out. I'm Bill Thompson from Pozo County. This is my good friend and pastor, Reverend Ike. And the good Reverend and I and his missus are down here looking for a missing link uh, to their family tree. So any cooperation uh, that you could give us would be most appreciated. Reverend? You a preacher? No, not really. What we're looking for is uh, my wife's granddad, well, his great granddad's stomping grounds. And what is he looking for? Well, it's an old uh, Confederate graveyard. It's supposedly just a few miles out of town. Oh, no. It's on the way to Whiskey Mountain. You know, in the summer, tourists ask about that place all the time. Everybody knows it doesn't exist. I mean, it just ain't real. You come up kind of late. Getting a little nippy. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> She's cuter than Bugsy, ain't she? <laughs> Hi, blue eyes. <laughs> Where are you going, you sweet thing, you? <laughs> It's just, there's probably a couple of wise guys hitting on her. Probably. Well, let's go lighten her up. There's no one there, Diane. What do you mean, Mr. Deputy? Go on, look for yourself. Let's go. 
Diane. Did you come on? Listen, uh, thank you very much. Sir. You ain't taking them sickles up in the hills, are you? Oh, yeah, that's all right. They're dirt bikes. Well, I wouldn't do that if I was you. Some of them mountain folk don't take strangers. Right. It's like them ones hanging around your wife out there. Why, that dirty... That son of a... think they were trying to put us off, right, Reverend? Right, Reverend, you turkey. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Now, why would they do that? I don't know, but my great-granddaddy wouldn't be wrong about a mountain. Oh, Jamie, that map's ancient. No, it isn't. He drew it 15 years ago, just before he died. <laughs> Look at the falls over the road. That's got to be Bridal Fail Falls. It's on the map. Oh, one for Jamie. Na 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 na. How's the leg, lady? Oh, terrific. <laughs> yeah, she's tough as nails. You know, it's uh, too bad you didn't fall on your head, uh, Diane. Huh? It'd hurt less. You, but I'm getting chumpy. Hey, it was Odin. Odin? Love God of the mountains. I told you we wouldn't need two sleeping bags, darling. Bob, oh, Bill. Tell him anything and he interprets it as irresistible. You know, with another drink, I don't think an animal in the forest is going to be safe. Maybe just a tad. Damn. Oh, no, Dan. One more drink and he'll sleep for the next three days. I don't know about you all, but I'm going to bed. Ah, oh, boo. 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 <laughs> Puff insist. You're looking up your ad noise, pal. Jamie, you did. Will you do me a favor? Why do women always have to drink your booze? They do it for my own good. They do it for your own good. Why do they don't worry about their stomachs? Guess who'll feel better in the morning? Well, I think she's got the right idea. Nighty night. I'm just getting the city off my back myself. I mean, look at these trees. You know, a tree never asked me. <laughs> People gave the trees up. <laughs> 
You don't know, tree don't go to the bathroom either. <laughs> you know what I'm People do, but trees don't. <laughs> I mean, this is what I thought about. You used to go hold the tree, and that's it. Why don't you go hold the tree? I'm going to go hold my... Still got my curiosity going. I'm game. Oh, shit. Here we go again.
I uh, tell you what, why don't you two do, uh, go on down and get cleaned up, and we'll uh, we'll fix up camp. Do you have my panties? Mm-hmm. Come on, let me have them. I don't have your panties. You don't have my panties? Then who took them? Not me. All right, come on now. Who's the wise guy? Who took my panties? Come on, Diane. Hey, don't look at me. I didn't take them. That's right. So what could have happened to them? Hey, come on, you two. Say what, why don't we uh, get up, put some coffee on, and if you don't have anything to wear, I'll... I'll loan you my jockey shorts. Sure aren't gonna be able to wait across this. Oh, 
I'm not so sure. Why don't you wait out there and check? Why'd you suck a rose? Oh, it'll work. It's just gonna take a couple of trips, that's all. I hope my life insurance is paid up, though. Because I can't swim! It is. I don't like it. Come on, come on! Do me a favor, Diane. What? Lighten up. Bill, you know as well as I know that we should have turned back a long time ago. You're right. Screw you, I don't want to be right. Then give me a kiss. You're so much, so much. I know. I know you do. Well, if this whatever vacation is making you happy, I guess I'll lighten up. Good.
You know, you're right. Let's get out of here tomorrow. Yes. In the meantime, I think I'm going to stay awake tonight. Someone's over there. Sure. with those fish are?
Oh, wow! <laughs> Trout, Trout. Man, you ever heard of a whiskey mountain? Whiskey man. Mm. here and we can take a look. According to the map, that's it. <laughs> Is this cabin yeah. on the map? No. Oh. No. Let's check it out. Let's check it in. Stay here to your chicken. Okay? Yeah. Don't dump your bike. Should be someone around here. I don't know, it looks deserted. Oh, hound dog. No, I'll not. Oh, yeah. No? The hell's he eating? Oh, wow. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Pretty good. <laughs> Not damn 20 years yet, lost your aim, boy. Hey, girls, come on, let's go. There's nothing up there, it's all locked up. The tunnel is just at the other end of this lake. Well, Bill suggested before, we just, uh, just leave the bikes here and go on up and take a look. Good idea. Okay, let's go. Hey, boy. Hey, boy. Yeah. You taking? No. <laughs> Oh. That tunnel won't be hard to find once we reach the ravine. Let's go. Hey, hey, slow down a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Ah, I'm 
sure we can oh, find it. Oh, come on, Greek. Stop arguing and keep moving. We heard him about it. Billy's a dope dealer. All right, let's get him up to the captain. Yeah, even his voice has changed. Why are you doing this? We haven't done anything. Because I got a million dollars of Primo headed for the city. And I can't have you jerks out there advertising it. Advertise? What, are you kidding? We're not going to tell anyone. I mean, I'll smoke a kilo right here on the spot. Yeah, yeah, but you uh... You know... Two days we tried to screw you all off. They all just kept coming and coming. You just wouldn't stop. Just call them plain stupid, Mr. Rudy. Oh, dumb. Not stupid. Dumb. You jeopardized our whole operation. You dumb idiots. All right, time up. Don't waste any more time on these morons. Hey, mister. We're just looking for muskets. Muskets? My granddaddy buried him, and his map led us to this cave. Uh, how the hell didn't you tell me that at the store? I ain't got no choice. <laughs> <laughs> She's the prettiest little thing you ever saw. <laughs> <laughs> Blonde hair and blue eyes. Wonder for cowards, match your cup. <laughs> Hi, honey. I think I love you. Oh, come on, you said that Mary Ann last week. You <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
scorching the grass out there to protect. And you guys are on a pleasure trip. Well, I told him you'd be mad, Mr. Rooney. You I told him shit. Now get out there, you and Jack, and get out and dig those graves. Now! Bowser, you stay here and help me keep an eye on these two. Tell Charlie and Luke to get down here out of the fields. I need them. Please don't! Put your clothes on. like that, huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, for first thing, you got the hat on backwards, you dummy. Turn it around. Okay. That's because when you hit a tree, you won't split that stupid skull of yours. Now, that's just like a stick shift. You understand, Jack? See, you have to turn the key on. That's what makes it go. Then right over here, that there is the clutch. See, you got to understand, that's what you pull first. Then down yeah. there, that there is... See that little old pedal down there? Stick your yeah. foot up. No, no, that's the foot rest. Put your toe under there. Under there, now that's it. That's the way you do it. And over there, that's the brake. That's for the back. That little one, that's right. This here, you know what this here is? That's for the front wheel. You hit that without hitting the back one, you're going to land up in that tree. How you start it? Now, see that big old thing sticking out there? Yeah. Just stomp on it. Hmm. On go! <laughs>
Let's get that second one. Look, we need some help. Our wives have been kidnapped and they're being held up at Whiskey Mountain. Come on, come on, come on, do something. Get the sheriff or somebody. What's all the commotion about, Leo? What's this about somebody getting kidnapped? You see, sir, it's our wives. Uh, we're up at Whiskey Mountain and planning some dope dealers. Bill and I have... Now, wait a minute, son. There ain't no dope dealers around here. And there ain't no such thing as Whiskey Mountain. That's just local bullshit. But they got my wife up there. And there is a guy named Rudy who has fields of grass. Grass? What's that? Grass. Grass is marijuana. Did you see any of it? Yeah, we saw bales of it, man. Now, I thought you said it was fields. Hey, Sheriff. They've got my wife up there. Well, if you ask me, I believe you boys have been smoking a little bit of that crazy stuff yourself. What the hell's wrong with you? We need some help. Are you gonna help us? Hell far, man. You ain't got no proof. There ain't no such thing as Whiskey Mountain. It's just a legend. Just local bullshit, that's all. And I don't believe you. I think all of you people are crazy. Badge and stick it. Now don't you go taking the law into your own hands. It won't work now, boy. You hear? It won't work. Let's get some guns. Guns?
Tell you what, Jane, you and Jess had better get in a stock of food and supplies. It's getting pretty cold. That's right, Frank. It looks like it's gonna be a cold winter. Jesse said all the animals got an extra thick coat of fur on them. Jesse's chopping a lot of extra firewood. What can I do for you? Yeah, we want to see a couple of shotguns. Let me get them for you. That's a real gun. How much you want for it? 139.95. Got another one? How much for this? 120 bucks. That's good, and I, uh, I like to have that knife right there. Yes, sir. Excuse me a minute. Frank's hardware. Right? Just tell them you gotta have a license or something. And if they give you any trouble, I'll be right on over. And listen, you do this for me, Stud. Get your tail on the crack. Call on me, I'll hit you out. Okay? Okay, I got you. I'm sorry, fellas. I can't let you have them guns. You're not arresting us this county. What the hell's going on here? You lie down. Flat on your stomach. Put your hands behind your head. To hell with you. Come on, come on, get on down. There's over $300 here. Now that's gonna cover everything we took. Jesus, Dan, cover my back till I'm loaded. Yeah, keep your eyes open for him. One of them might have followed us all the way into town. Well, Dan? here comes one of them. Let's go. Fire! Get it! Fire!
Hey, Bill, come on, man. Tell me. Try to circle around and flush him out.
Diane. 